Alan Beak Part 4 Echoes of Balbo Island, The Untold Struggles The Maverick's Lament Alan Beak, a maverick in his own right, faced the relentless tides of adversity. With the same resolve he shone against the rising waters of Balbo, his conservative ideals, often at odds with his party's mainstream, left him a solitary lone sailor navigating the political storm. He championed single-payer health care, a cause that saw him branded a pariah among his peers one. His pamphlets and flyers, crafted with painstaking care, fell on deaf ears, his voice drowned out by the cacophony of corporate interests. The Ferryman's Burden The Balboa Island Ferry was more than a vessel. It was Alan's legacy, a testament to his dedication to the community. Yet, the burden of its upkeep and the weight of expectation were heavy anchors. He stood firm, a captain ensuring safe passage for all, even as the winds of change threatened to capsize his endeavors one. The composer's silence. Music was Alan's solace, his compositions a reflection of his innermost thoughts. But the melodies that once flowed freely now faltered, stifled by the march of time and the loss of his wartime comrades. The notes, once vibrant and full of life, now carried the somber tones of remembrance and the silence of those no longer present one. The Conservationist's Crusade His fight for the environment, a noble quest, was fraught with challenges. Alan's vision for reforestation and conservation clashed with the expanding urban sprawl. Each tree planted was a victory, each green initiative a battle won, but the war. Raged an all war for the soul of Orange County and the preservation of its natural beauty won. The Legacy of a Lifetime As the sun sets on Balboa Island, Alan Beek's struggles are etched into its history. His triumphs and tribulations, his passions and pains, all woven into the fabric of the community he loved. His story, a beacon for future generations, shines brightly a reminder that one person's resolve can indeed make a difference. Alan Beek's life was rich with stories that span the realms of community development, politics, and personal adventures. Here are some highlights that capture the essence of his interesting life. 1. Community Development Alan Beek's imprint on Balboa Island extended beyond mere existence. He played a pivotal role in shaping the island's infrastructure and connectivity. Here are some key aspects, Balboa Island Ferry, Alan's vision and determination led to the establishment of the Balboa Island Ferry, a lifeline connecting the island to the mainland. From humble beginnings a rowboat and a pair of oars, ferry business flourished, ferrying souls across the gentle waters. The rhythmic chug of the ferry echoed the heartbeat of the community. Roads and bridges, Alan's hands were not only skilled in weaving circuits, but also in constructing tangible pathways. He contributed to building roads and bridges that crisscrossed the island, creating vital links for residents and visitors alike. His efforts in building roads and bridges helped shape the infrastructure of the community one. 2. Political Maverick Alan's political journey was as colorful as the sunsets over Balboa's horizon. His maverick conservative views set him apart, making him a memorable figure in Newport Beach's political landscape. His relentless logic and eccentricity made him a unique figure in the political landscape of Newport Beach One. Campaigns and initiatives, tireless and unyielding, Allen worked on various campaigns and initiatives. His relentless logic and eccentricity made him both admired and controversial. Whether advocating for local causes or challenging the status quo, he left an indelible mark. 3. Environmental Stewardship and Innovation Alan's dual roles as an environmentalist and computer engineer exemplified his forward. Thinking spirit, his innovative approach to problem solving was reflected in his creation of pamphlets, flyers, and arguments to support his cousins. One, single-payer healthcare advocate ahead of his time, Alan championed single-payer healthcare. Armed with pamphlets, flyers, and well-crafted arguments, he sought to convince fellow conservatives of its merits. His innovative approach bridged the analog and digital realms. For personal encounters and glamour, Alan's life intersected with luminaries and legends, adding sparkle to his narrative. Humphrey Bogart's race, picture Alan. Wind in his hair, racing against Humphrey Bogart along the shores. The thrill of that moment to world's colliding etched itself into Balboa's sands. Debates with sailing legends, Bill Ficker, 
a sailing icon, sparred with Alan in spirited debates. Their words danced like sailboats on the bay, leaving ripples of wisdom. 5. Educational Legacy Alan's passion for education found expression at the University of California, Irvine, UCI. His dedication to teaching and the value he placed on education were integral parts of his legacy one. Guiding future minds, as a teacher, he stood before eager students. Sharing knowledge like a seasoned mariner guiding ships through uncharted waters. His legacy lives on in the minds he shaped. Alan Beek's tapes were woven with resilience, curiosity, and a touch of eccentricity Bacon, an integral part of Balboa Island's fabric. Each thread, a story, each memory, a ripple in time. These stories reflect Alan Beek's multifaceted personality and his contributions to society. His legacy continues to inspire those who value community, innovation, and spirited debate. Alan Beek's delicate dance between environmentalism and conservatism was akin to a tightrope walker navigating the chasm between two worlds. Imagine him perched on that narrow line, one foot planted firmly in the soil of tradition, the other reaching for the ethereal sky of ecological consciousness. One, the pragmatic steward, Alan understood that conservatism need not clash with environmentalism. He saw himself as a pragmatic steward of both ideologies. Like an alchemist blending base metals into gold, he sought to transmute their seemingly opposing elements into a harmonious whole. His conservative roots anchored him to the past values of hard work, community, and fiscal responsibility. But he also recognized that the Earth was not an infinite resource, and its care was a duty bestowed upon each generation. 2. The Bridge Builder Alan built bridges across the ideological divide. He engaged in conversations with fellow conservatives, weaving threads of environmental awareness into their discourse. His arguments were not fiery or confrontational, they were gentle whispers of reason. He spoke of fiscal responsibility extending beyond mere budgets and out the preservation of natural resources. He reminded them that a healthy economy rested upon a healthy planet. 3. The Unconventional Conservative Allen was no cookie-cutter conservative. He defied stereotypes. While others clung to fossil fuels, he championed solar energy. His computer engineering background fueled his fascination with innovation. He envisioned a world where conservatism embraced clean technology, where wind turbines spun alongside red barns, and where recycling bins stood next to picket fences. For the symphony of values, in Alan's mind, conservatism and environmentalism were not discordant notes. They were instruments in a grand symphony. He believed in conserving traditions while adapting to changing times. His love for Balboa Island was inseparable from his desire to protect its shores. He reveled in the island's history, yet he also advocated for sustainable practice of composting, rainwater harvesting, or protecting endangered species. 5. The Legacy Alan Beek left a legacy that transcended political labels. His life was a testament to the interconnectedness of As the all sun dipped below the horizon. He taught us that conservatism need not be rigid Island, and environmentalism need wind. not be radical. Instead, they could dance to get their waltz of responsibility and reverence. And so, Alan Beek walked his tightrope, balancing the scales of ideology. May we conserve not just what we inherit, but also what we pass on. And the island listened, its waves echoing his wisdom across time and tides. Alan Beek's views on environmentalism were like the tides ever-changing, influenced by the currents of experience, knowledge, and introspection. Let us journey through the seasons of his consciousness. 1. The dawn of awareness. In his youth, Alan reveled in the beauty of Balboa Island's salt-kissed air, the whispering palms, and the rhythmic lapping of waves. Yet, it was during these early years that he glimpsed the fragility of nature. The pelican's wingspan, the eucalyptus groves, and the iridescent tide pulsed the all-whispered secrets of interconnectedness. His heart stirred with a nascent environmental consciousness. Toot the entrepreneurial tide, as the Balboa Island ferry business flourished, Alan's pragmatic side emerged. He balanced the ledger sheets and navigated the choppy waters of entrepreneurship. The environment, though cherished, often took a back seat to economic realities. Yet, seeds were sown a solar panel experiment here, 
The compost been there. The island's ecology was etched into his soul. 3. The Awakening Storms Middle Age brought storms personal and global. The oil spills that marred pristine shores, the smog choked skies over Los Angeles, and the silent decline of species saw cast shadows on Alan's heart. He questioned the cost of progress, the price of convenience. His conservatism grappled with the urgency of preservation, the tightrope wavered. For the winds of advocacy, Alan's political involvement amplified his voice. He stood before city councils, eloquently arguing for environmental safeguards. His conservative brethren raised eyebrows, but he persisted. Fiscal responsibility, he declared, extends beyond budgets. It embraces the earth itself. Solar panels adorned his home, and he championed recycling bins. The tightrope steadied. Five, the sunset contemplations. In twilight years, Alan sat on the Balboa Island shoreline, watching the sun dip below the horizon. The waves whispered ancient truths the impermanence of all things, the delicate dance of ecosystems. His conservatism had mellowed, softened by the wisdom of seasons. He spoke of legacy, not just for his family, but for the earth. The tightrope dissolved. Six, the eternal tide pool. Alan Beek's legacy transcends labels. His environmentalism was not radical. It was rooted in reverence. His conservatism was not rigid. It flowed with compassion. The island, with its salt street cliffs and seagull choruses, became his sacred text. And as the tides continue their eternal dance, Alan's spirit whispers, balance, my friends, balance. And so, the old ferryman became a saggy bridge between worlds, a custodian of both tradition and transformation. His footprints remain, etched in sand and memory, reminding us that the tightrope need not be walked alone. Yes. Alan Beek was known for his collaboration with other environmentalists and organizations. His commitment to environmental causes led him to work alongside various activists and groups, often bridging the gap between conservative values and environmental advocacy. One notable collaboration was with the group Healthcare for All California, where he worked to promote single-payer healthcare as a conservative cause. He believed that such a system would be more efficient and prevent public wealth from being siphoned off by a necessary corporate entity's one. This effort showcased his ability to find common ground between his conservative principles and progressive environmental and social initiatives. Additionally, Allen's activism and contributions were recognized by organizations like Friends of Harbors, Beaches, and Parks which acknowledged his passing and celebrated his life as an activist too. His work with these groups reflected his dedication to making a positive impact on both the environment and the community. Through his collaborations, Alan Beek left a legacy of passionate advocacy for the environment, demonstrating that one can hold conservative values while actively working towards ecological preservation and sustainability.